There are five different categories of colors within the Lumiere line. All the colors are mica combined with pigments, but each category has its own effect. The pure metallic colors consist of 14 colors, four of which are gold. We have brushed each color across the striped canvas in order to show Lumiere's effects on three different colored grounds, raw canvas, gessoed canvas, and black canvas. Many of the metallic colors only differ in the size of the pigment particle. Bright gold is just a bigger and brighter metallic gold. Lumiere is a heavy-bodied, completely opaque paint. It sticks to almost any surface, like wood, leather, fabric, or canvas. The durability of the paint is also excellent. The metallic colors are highly reflective and approximate the look of a wide range of metals. Brass is the brightest and most reflective because it is formulated with a larger mica particle than any other color. Old brass, on the other hand, is both smaller in particle size and darker in color, yielding a much more subdued and antique brass. The pearlescent colors are formulated with white mica pigments paired with traditional pigments. Super Sparkle and Pearlescent White are another pair that share a pigment. The Super Sparkle version is much larger and more reflective. The pearlescent colors are vibrant and show up especially well on dark backgrounds. Pearlescent Magenta and Pearlescent Turquoise can almost be thought of as pastel metallics. Pearlescent Blue, Pearlescent Violet, and Pearlescent Emerald are deep, reflective colors that maintain the rich pearlescence for which the Lumiere line is famous. The halo colors are formulated with both metallic mica pigments and traditional pigments. This produces two-toned iridescent effects. These colors are especially dimensional on dark backgrounds or if they are applied lightly with a sponge, brush, or stamp. Three of the four halo colors are formulated with traditional pigments paired with gold mica. Gold has a yellowish color, so halo blue gold tends to appear more green than blue, while halo pink gold tends to look almost orange. When you look closely, you can see the two distinct colors. The wine country colors are the newest addition to the Lumiere line. These colors were chosen to reflect the palette of the landscape in which Lumiere is manufactured, beautiful Healdsburg, California. The wine country colors are made with very finely ground mica pigments and are more subdued than the other Lumiere colors. The wine country colors do maintain the rich reflective quality of mica, however, and are excellent choices whenever you need a paint to pop just a touch more than a traditional pigment system. The intensity of these colors, coupled with the richness native to mica, yields especially deep and vibrant colors. You can almost taste grape and burgundy glistens like wine. Highlight colors are formulated with interference mica pigments. Interference pigments have a thin coating and are translucent. They therefore look different depending on the surface on which they are applied. On a white background, light shines through the pigment, reflects off the white ground, and shines back out, passing again through the pigment particles. The overwhelming majority of the reflected light is white light, so you see the paint as being only barely tinted, or a highlighting effect. Painting on black, on the other hand, the effect is quite different. Black absorbs light, so the only light that makes it back to your eye is the light that reflects off the mica surface. Painted on black, the highlight colors read well and vividly. To get a sense of this, paint a highlight color on a black and white background, just like this tie. All the white areas will become tinted and shiny while the black will become blue, red, or violet, depending on the highlight color you use. You can also vary the thickness of application for different effects. Lumiere 3D is a new line of dimensional paint. In addition to its very heavy body, Lumiere 3D acts as a super durable, super strong adhesive that can be used to make long-lasting 3D creations.
Zombie, oh zombie. 